All right, once and for all, today we're gonna put this to rest. <laughs> One way or another. Yeah, if you are watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking the video and hope you've been enjoying it so far. The series, the playthrough, whatever you want to call it. It's Friday. All I'm going to think about as I'm playing this now is just the Yoshi that uh, we saw last night. It's just... Um, yeah, this is the day after... Nintendo revealed more gameplay for the new Super Mario Brothers Wonder game. And it looks great. I'm really looking forward to it. Looks like a really good platformer. Yahoo. But one thing that I immediately notice is the voice of Yoshi in that game is different. Just completely different. So Yoshi also visually looks like he did in the 1990s, which I love. But the main thing is this sound here is completely different, and it sounds a lot better. So, I'm really looking forward to that. Um, doing great, Hooked on Forager. I feel like I've heard of that game before. That's like the one that's pixel art, right? And it's... I wouldn't call it a farming sim, but it's, it's like in that realm of things. Survival, farming, if I'm not wrong. Also, Hello Zelda as well. Uh, yeah. So that game's not too far away, and it looks like they're just visually changing things, but also because, you know, Charles isn't voicing stuff anymore, I guess. They use this as, a, as an opportunity to just mix things up, but it looks like everything has just different voices this time around. I should be looking in the background. I'm playing as I say that, it's over there. No, but the box is there, I can see it. How do I hit it? Or is it like right at the very start? Hang on. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing all right, just wrapped up work. <laughs> I've been... Oh no, I see, it's not the thing. I've been just... For the last month, updating all the thumbnails on the VODs channel to, like, be in the new style, because they seem to work better. So, I didn't have to do this, but this is just for the sake of... I like being consistent. So, yeah, I went and changed... I'm almost done. Like, I've done them all, it's just... YouTube has a hard limit on how many thumbnails you can upload a day. I didn't know this. So, I can only do so many per day. And I'm down to like the last 15 or so, so... It's pretty much done. Everything's looking nice. But that's what I've been doing, like, just in the background, like, once a day. Before I eat some food, I go update some thumbnails. <laughs> I've also made it so if I, I guess if I want to do it again in future, it's like just a single point where I do it and then everything kind of just updates and I just need to re-upload them, so. Yeah, anyway, <laughs> that's about it. It's Father's Day this weekend, so I gotta, gotta go out tomorrow and buy something. I'm hoping that whatever's left boss challenge-wise isn't too bad. I also want to hit up some flea markets this weekend. There's a couple going on, so I'm going to see if I can find 
some Sega stuff in particular. Now that I've, I've played my first Sega game properly, I kind of want to do more of them. be hidden behind one of these things. I can just feel it already. Someone I was talking to about the Mario game today. They said it looks too weird for them. I'm like, it's too weird? Like, yeah, it looks too weird. And I was like, dude, Mario's always been weird. <laughs> like, if you think about it, if you go back as far as you can remember for your first Mario game, just think about what you do in that game conceptually. The game is fucking weird. It always has been. That hasn't changed. It is by no means grounded in reality. I think it's just the elephant thing that has thrown people off. I kind of love it. <laughs> just anything that is just so dumb and makes you go, what the fuck, is just great. Oh man, the Luigi transformation thing got me yesterday, that was funny. It's exactly the same as Mario, but I just like to imagine Luigi is just shocked as it happens the first time, and is just scared. Like, I can't, I can't imagine... I can't imagine the transformation would be non-jarring. Because, I mean, most of the other ones, it looks like they're just putting on a suit. With the exception of what happens in Odyssey. But they're physically morphing their bodies into an elephant's body. I guess the line for some people was the elephant became the literal elephant in the room. <laughs> hey, Nick. Uh, doing well. Just wrapped up work. I want to put an end to this today, so most likely later I'll have to fight that boss. It'll either be that I get it done or I give up on that boss just trying to do things perfect, because that's what it's going to be. It's... What's next on the platter? I need to finish Tunic. I want to go through... Um, Tunic. And then... This... I mean, I got a couple of retro games I want to check out. Tunic's a lot of fun. I gotta think about my time carefully because from this month, it's September now, there's just gonna be stuff constantly coming out that I wanna check out. How are the controls? They're pretty fluid. Um, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't call it, like, as good as Dead Cells combat, but it's, it's about that. Mm -hmm. 
Like, it feels pretty good. I think the thing that's the biggest appeal out of the art style is just... What it represents conceptually is, is just... Any old game you would have played as a kid where you wouldn't have read the manual. Or the manual would have, like, explained things that were required, but then... It was kind of in a foreign language to you. Or it felt like that. That's, I think that's what I like the most about this game, is... That's pretty much how Zelda 1 felt to me at times. So you're kind of discovering things as you go. That help you progress. It's not the hardest Souls-like game, but the challenge is there. I haven't seen this box thing. It's gonna be in an annoying spot. Um, so, the next game I wanna check out is Sea of Stars. Which is an RPG game, and... It's a pixel art RPG game. It looks really, really visually nice. And it's got the the music producer of um, Chrono Trigger involved, which is like one of my favorite RPGs of all time. It's just, yeah, just released and people are saying it's really, really good, so. It's gonna be that and then I'm not sure what else. I'll definitely have some retro games in the middle, but... Um... I need to fit- I was thinking probably ending New Leaf and then starting New Horizons, so then it's kind of got that going on. And then I, I really want to play like a story game, so like action story, so either God of War Ragnarok or uh, fuck, what was the other one? Like continuing Yakuza, because I need to continue that series. I'm leaning more towards God of War just because we played like a dragon not too long ago. Yeah, Rag God of War Ragnarok's kind of been sitting on my desk for a while, so... I'm leaning more towards that one. I, I, yeah, God I know God of War Ragnarok is good. The reason I didn't play it right away was one, it was way too expensive when it came out, and two... I got the feeling that people didn't want spoilers and probably weren't going to watch anyway, which is fine. It's just... I kind of realized that with, when it comes to the large games that a lot of people are going to play, it's like... It's better to just stream them later, more often than not, unless I'm, like, that super interested in playing them day one where I don't care. So I got a boy, I waited for the price to come down, and yeah, I, I picked it up, so... I got it here. That's pretty much what I was thinking. There's just too much... This year has been absolutely stacked when it comes to game releases. Like, last year felt pretty empty by comparison. We only had... I'd say, like, a few major games in that year. Whereas in this year, it's, it's just been completely stacked, like, from start to finish. I feel like this is the only month where I felt like, okay, I can go back and go through the backlog a little. But let's see, September we got the Pikmin physical copies of 1 and 2, and I want to give that game a try. 
We have Mario RPG, which 100% playing that, waiting on that. Like, that's a game that I'm really looking forward to. Then in October, we have Mario... Um, what do you call it? The one that we saw yesterday. I've read Wonder, jeez. Super Mario Bros. Wonder, there's a WarioWare game somewhere in the middle of that as well. I'm pretty sure that November and December there's going to be new stuff as well that they haven't announced, so... I'm fully expecting the Elden Ring DLC to get announced as, as well. Like, they said sometime towards the end of this year, so... I reckon the surprise drop will be like Silk Song will get a release date and it'll be before the end of the year. Like, I'm, I'm gonna call that now. Because it was supposed to come out in the middle of the year. So it's either it's been delayed six months or it's been delayed 12. So we'll see which it is. Okay, uh... I guess go up this way. And then I just have the central path to go up. Um, also, I've kind of decided on the PC upgrade when it's going to happen. I've been spending the last couple of weeks looking into it, so... If I look... The looks of it, graphics cards aren't going to change for at least the next year. Like, year and a half, maybe? With the new ones releasing, like, the end of 2024 is, like, the prediction. So those, those are fine. Processor-wise, um, there's new ones coming out in the next month. So pretty much, when those drop, I'll, I'll look into upgrading my PC, because then it's a good time. And by upgrading, I mean getting a whole new one, because this thing is, like, seven, eight years old, almost. So. It just depends how long they take to release the processors in Australia. Usually it's not too far away, but... Definitely before the end of the year it's going to happen. Like, I'm predicting November. I'll, by November I'll have a new setup. And 1440p will be more of a common thing. The exception being the Switch and I guess the retro consoles, but even that, like, I, I have something that I'm looking into that I could probably use to upscale stuff. The video quality will improve again because I'll just use that new codec. Though Twitch doesn't support it, at least the VODs will. So they'll just look pristine on YouTube. But also a new computer, just means I can handle more. I don't have to play things in medium quality, like... Some of the games that I've played lately, I've had to turn the quality down. Because I just can't capture them. Without it, like, doing some frame hiccups. Oh, there it is. This honestly wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. I thought looking for this thing was going to be a pain, but it was fine. Hello, Messiah. How's it going? How's things? I'm not going to miss this theme. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. Oh, man. 
Doing great, only a little bit tired. Oh, that's fine, only a little bit. I mean, it is, what, like, five in the morning? <laughs> you have every right to be as tired as you want to be. That was Friday. It was alright. It was work. Um, just during my lunch break, looked more into computer stuff because I want to upgrade soon, so I kind of have a plan for it now. And, uh, just talking more about the new Mario game. Like, looks great. Yoshi's gonna be a thick boy again, like he used to be in the 90s. More importantly, his his sounds are now different. Oh, it got in the way. I need egg. Where is egg? Give egg. One egg. No, the new Mario game looks really good. Just it's gonna be another one of those games that's just gonna make me happy. It looks visually fantastic. Egg! Hey! Eggs! Okay, that's all I needed. I'm going to finish this game today, so I'm just doing the last things, which is the boss challenges and the ultimate final boss challenge. But first I'm doing the hide and seek stuff, which getting there. Okay, so what's the challenge here? Break two or more ivies. Okay, I got a minute and twenty three to beat it in. boss works. Let me just remember how this boss works. Alright, oh, like, okay, I get it. Yeah, this is gonna be tricky to, to do quickly. Does it mean these? Hang on. Let's just see what it means by ivies. Like two or more of them. What? How do you break them? How do you... I need to figure this out first before I try. Oh, like that. I hope it doesn't mean those things. I might try and do this this thing first. Okay, that's what it means by that. I'll fin I'll finish the boss now, so then I don't have to do that challenge. 
I think I might have to just to cut down the time. This is gonna be brutal to try and get done in a minute and twenty. What a minute and twenty-three? That's highly specific. First, first thing done. Also, something from yesterday that I noticed. Hang on, I'll bring the image up. It, it made me laugh when I when I saw it again today because I I rewatched the trailer. Um, one sec. Look at look at this face. <laughs> that's Yoshi. That's the new Yoshi when it has something in its mouth. Ugh. That's, that's such a good face. Okay, I need to put that costume back on. I mean, as long as it's got a lot of health, it doesn't matter. I'll wear this one now. Okay, so don't take damage and do it in a minute 32. Okay. quick with the egg throwing. Took damage. Let me go for the time one. I'll go for. The, I can still get the time one. No, I'm not gonna get it. Dude. Was I like 0.6 off? If I hadn't gotten a V, if I wouldn't have gotten eaten, I, would, I think I would have gotten it. <sighs> I was 0.65 off. <laughs> okay, try again. No, that emote is, is so good, the Wario Shake thing. I felt half tempted to speed it up so it's quicker, but I left that as is.
And just imagine that glorious booty going twice as fast. So if we have like high paced music, so it goes into overdrive. I'm gonna do the time-based one again. I think I just have to focus on one goal at a time. I have to pretty much nail him the moment it's... There we go. Alright, time one's done. Now I just need to do this whole thing without taking damage. Okay. Clear without taking damage. Now, time doesn't matter. I can... Just step back and make sure I don't take a hit. Just don't, just don't take a hit. Just don't take a hit. Uh -huh. Time doesn't matter. Oh, okay. Fuck, <laughs> that is... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Hang on. Maybe the moment that starts charging, I can move out of the way. The boss fights in this game have been really good. I almost got away from it. I was just slightly off from not.
Oh, yeah, no, fuck yourself. Fuck yourself, yeah. That's it. <laughs> I'm gonna regret, like, just... I don't have to 100% things. But it's just because this game reminds me so much of Yoshi's Island that, like, my inner child is like, Nah, you did this as a kid! 100% the game! You gotta, you gotta do it! Come on, man, this is, this is a kid's game! Look at the box, it says G. That means that eight-year-olds can do this. My eight-year-old self could do this. Okay. Don't fuck up. <laughs> Oh. No, I missed her! Egg. 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 Oh, they come from above. Okay. Shit, I have to do it again. No, but. Oh God. Yeah. I'm so angry. <sighs> I missed. I missed. I missed. I, I can't believe I missed that shot. Jeez. Oh, I don't know what it is about platformers, man, but it's just... They always do this to me. Like, it just brings out this visceral, <laughs> raw fucking emotion that I can't keep bottled up. This is the one. I'm playing with the pro controller again. I just realized that. There we go. <laughs> All right. Okay, that's done. Good. Yay! Okay, um... So now it's just the central path now, so we go... One, two, three... Four... Oh, jeez, there's still a lot to do, but most of them are hide-and-seek stages, so... If you missed out on some of these stages, you get to see them. I think it's cool the variety of stages this has. Yahoo! 
All right, be on the lookout for the box. Box friend. I can only imagine just the challenges people are going to do in the new Mario game, particularly with that invisibility badge. Like, you know there's some madman that's going to try and finish the whole game with that badge. <laughs> or like the badge that forces you to run. Okay, that was easy. The invisibility thing is just straight up out of Warrior Land. <laughs> that was in Warrior Land. <sighs> I'm still holding out that they're gonna, like, just bring a new Warrior game. How- how long? <laughs> the only other series that haven't gotten as much love... ...have been, um... Star Fox and F-Zero. They're, they're about equal in terms of uh, new games not coming out for them. I mean, at least Warrior's got WarioWare, but... I don't know. <laughs> it would make me so happy. I guess Donkey Kong as well, if you think about it. Like, Tropical Freeze, though, it did come out on the Switch. The game is from the Wii U, so it's been a while. I thought they were going to do more with Donkey Kong, to be honest, because I remember that Tropical Freeze sold really well. Like, way more than it ever did on the Wii U. So I was thinking, oh, they're probably going to make more of these. But they haven't. I haven't seen the box friend yet. Okay. 13 to go. Pretty much there. I'm still really surprised at how much there is to do in this game. It's just that, it's fine. I've had a couple of the box friends be at the very start of the stage before anything. <sighs> Gotta remember tomorrow, like... So I'm going to look for fa a Father's Day present, but then also, like, I did say I was going to try that, that coffee. The, the pumpkin spice thing that Americans keep telling me to try. Because <laughs> unfortunately there's a Starbucks at the place that I'm going to. I got no excuse, it's, it's going to be there. The only excuse I have is, like, I don't want to, but even then, it's like, ah, oh, That's not that big of an ask. 
And at least it's something to talk about. The thing is, it's probably going to be better than I think it is because my expectations are very low. So that can only surprise me. The other possibility is maybe they just don't make it the same way. Like, who knows? We'll see. I'll report back tomorrow at some point. See box friend anyway, yeah. They just have tiny daggers. Okay, box friend is not there. until the new Yoshi sound is standard and I, we won't have to hear this anymore. I don't think it bothers anyone else. I think it just... It's just me. <laughs> Maybe. Just, I remember the first time hearing it as a kid and I was like, wait, no, this, this is not... This is not Yoshi. The other, the other sounds Yoshi makes are fine. It's just that sound. I'm so glad it's being replaced. Hang on, let's look in the background. Mm. Okay, well that's the boss, so I've missed it. Okay. I need everyone to look. You see box... Th there. There's a box there. I'm not sure if it's box friend, but there is indeed a... Oh, it's a point of no return. You suck. Okay. It might be that. It might not be. Let's see. But shout if you see box friend. Like, I, I, I would rather get up to the point where I'm fighting the final boss. The hide and seek, that's fine. Like, I don't mind. This is just because I've gone this far, I may as well finish it. That's gotta be what I saw at the end there. Oh, right, here first. Yeah, 
The only thing I wish from the new Mario game was that you could just play as Yoshi without the the whole. I mean, I don't know how to describe it. It's like it's easy mode. Oh shit! Hang on, I left my messenger app running on the desktop. It's probably gonna make noises. <laughs> close it, so then people don't think it's their shit going off. Sorry if you thought that was you. <laughs> I'm usually pretty good with that, but sometimes I forget. Thankfully I don't have work apps on, on this computer, otherwise that, that would probably be worse if, like, the sound notification for Slack or something went off. <laughs> probably give Pete Loki give people a little anxiety. Thinking work's trying to contact them. I'm muting my phone right now. There's, there's a conversation going on with my brothers. It's uh, it's about Starfield, that new game that's that's just come out. Surprisingly, it seems like. The game is going to be fine. Uh, they haven't made it a, a disaster. Like, if you enjoy Bethesda RPGs, it looks like it's going to be a, a fun game. Oh, it's okay. I can fall. I can fall. It's not like some of the stages I've been doing the past couple of days. <laughs> like, go back to classic mode where you can't fall into a hole. It has to be this. No? I haven't seen... Okay, so this is a point of no return. It's not that. So where is Box Friend? Don't tell me it's like a line of sight thing somewhere down here. No? Whenever it's something that you can't see right away, like, it's usually... You have to move a bit slower, because it's gonna be something that gets shown when the camera's in a very specific spot. Don't you dare. <laughs> Costume gone. I'm gonna have to put a new one on. Let me just... Make sure that it's not trying to be tricky. Why do I get the feeling it's going to be at the start of the stage and I just missed out on it? Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh oh. No hit. Ah, <laughs> there it is. <laughs> okay. Hiding in plain sight. Sure. Now uh, that's all of them for this area. These stages are great. I think visually this is the one that I like second most. The ice one is my favorite. The ice one was so great. The first time I'm saying that an ice level was good. Loud right now. Oh my god, it's not really that loud. Oh my god, it's not really that loud. It's not loud at all. Oh yes, it is. No, it's not. Oh yes, it is. No, it's not. Music is getting louder. Come on, everyone, you know the words. <laughs> I've made up a whole ass song. Because I've heard this theme so many damn times. Like, to the point where it's a duet where one person is playing the recorder. And the other person is complaining about it. Like, I have a whole story to the damn song. Seen box friend yet? There you are. Okay. Almost down to the last turn. I'm hoping that the last boss is going to be achievable. Wait a minute. Shit. Is this... Is it gonna make me do... Hang on. I wonder if the baby Bowser fight is gonna be something that I have to do like a challenge on. Hmm. I did not consider that. I 
would they even do that? Why would they even do to that fight? This is my least favorite level. It's just the snake thing. Just having to wait for the snake. I think it's... When it comes to Battle Toads as a snake level, and it kind of reminds me of that, I only got up to that stage once in my life. Granted, I haven't been trying constantly, but like... That's about as far as I ever got in that game. Which I don't even think is the halfway mark. Like, that game is insane. I get to what, like stage four and then everything, <laughs> it's just, that's it, it's just, stage four is a 50-50 chance I get through it, and then stage five is like, most of the time I will fail it. If not every time. I get the feeling box friend is going to be hidden behind boxes. Why don't I call him Box Buddy? That's like more catchy. BB. Box Chum. Box Compadre. Compadre de caja. <laughs> I don't want to go into Spanish territory. <laughs> we beat the we beat the cartón, I guess. It's cardboard box. I don't know. Spanish is super rusty. It's one or the other. I just didn't want to default to like saying the word amigo or amigo. <laughs> it's just, I don't know, that's like the go to word for, for everything. Oh shit. Mistakes were made. Egg, please. See him. Now we get to see why I don't like the stage. It's just this reason. Oh, 
I get the feeling it's it's not here. There's no way it would hide in such a weird spot. Okay. So No! Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Stupid frogs. Snake, please. I'm just looking for my friend. Uh -huh. Friend. Uh -huh. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I feel like I've, I've been making too many noises too early. Sneaky. Okay. Was in a pretty blind spot. Extra eyes on this one. <laughs> Spot the box, friend. I'm not going to shoot at anything. Oh, but it's in it's in the background. This level is great, it just reminds me of Timon and Pumbaa's jungle games. There was a slingshot game that was pretty much this. It's like one of the greatest kids games. I guess this one's a bit more lenient because it doesn't have things that can take points away. So it was like, shoot the animals that look the most evil. So if you hit an animal with a slingshot that looked like it was a good animal, you would lose points. And sometimes it was kind of hard to tell right away. <laughs> like, how do you judge that? It was pretty much just like, if the animal had resting bitch face, <laughs> hit it with the slingshot. Which I don't agree with. It's like, just because someone looks that way doesn't mean that they're an angry evil person. So 
sometimes they can be very, very nice. Probably nicer than people with a smile on their face. Do not see box friend anywhere. Concerning. I have not spotted out Box Friend yet. What? This is the end of the stage. so we don't go through a load screen. Uh, yeah, I, d I did not see Box Friend anyway. about the stage of this gathering X sometimes is really inaccurate. Like right now. Everything's fine. That's it for this. Oh no, okay, boss challenge. Uh, 135, clear without taking damage, break two or more alarms. Break two. Two or more alarms. I'll find out what that means. I'll probably just go for that separately. Locos, don't take damage. It's alright. Try for one thing at a time. What does it mean by alarms? Oh, that. Those are alarms, those are... Are they alarms? I call them boom gates. Okay. I would call those boom gates, not alarms. 
I don't know, am I wrong? <laughs> thinking like what the hell is an alarm in this stage okay that makes sense now all right so yeah getting this in the time it wants me to get it is gonna be tough One gold on. One minute thirty five. Jeez. Okay. Without taking damage and one minute thirty five. be better. <laughs> I was just off. Just by a little bit. But pretty much I, I have to hit it every time right away. There's no leeway. There we go. again. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely have to start again now. Alright. Why did I do what? I'm not focusing. I gotta stand still. Okay, wait for it. There we go. Like, I have to bait it into attacking me. I'm not trying to avoid it here. If I can't hit it in time, I don't deserve to win anyway. that a lot. There we go. Nice, solid hit. Okay. I have one egg. I just gotta get it right. Okay, now I have multiple eggs. Never mind. This is the hardest part now. Can't stop it. Yes! <laughs> Got it. Let's go. No damage and time.
Okay. I mean, I actually got all three. But, you know, I'd already gotten the other one separately. Okay. That one was straightforward. These stages are good as well. I like these stages. Except the start of this one with the clown music. Music is getting louder. Oh my god, it's so fucking loud right now. That was easy. Hang on. I need to put myself in harm's way. Nearly there. This is the good stage now. I wonder if they're gonna change the sound of that, like that. <laughs> Ooh, so far, what they've shown of the new Yoshi voice and everything, I, I really like it. It's definitely an upgrade, I think. Probably shouldn't go through this so haphazardly. This thing drives me it, it drives me nuts. <laughs> Just <laughs> They hit it in the same spot, it moves in a different direction. Why? I thought that maybe if you wanted it to go to a particular side, you hit the opposite side. It doesn't seem to work that way. It just seems to do whatever it wants. I wonder if I should ride these up a little higher. Just in case it's, I don't know, chilling on a planet or something. That almost looks like a box. <laughs> I can't beat that. Okay. 
kind of worried because it's almost the end of the stage. I still haven't seen Box Friend yet. It's not up here, and not at the end of the stage. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do. We'll see. Yeah, I don't see it here. Oh, no, there we go. Cool. Seven more to go. I love these little robots. They are pretty much the embodiment of like, when you're trying to help out, you panic and then you make things worse. <laughs> That's... It's like a situation that's fine and just because you panic it just becomes a mess. That's these little robots. Their whole existence is that. about to. It's about to. Panic! <laughs> Don't think it's over there. These have been going pretty quickly. This stage is nice looking as well. I like the stage visually. Look how nice the water looks. Particularly at the waterfall parts. Thank you. 
there nothing here, right? No. Okay. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jeez. I'm not sure how I got away with that one. There it is. I see it. May as well put the coins, just in case. Never know, it could be one more set of things to spend money on. Pretty much there. check here. I don't think it's here, but I'll check. Yeah, it's not. There's a bottom part to this, but it's not here. Uh, I'll check, but I, uh, yeah, it's not here. Oh. Crap. <laughs> I went too low. There we go. Let's still my sign a box, friend. I think I know where he's gonna be. over here somewhere. Oh. <laughs> Look, right there. Okay. This stage is a lot of fun. But I don't have to bother racing, just look for box friend. I'm just gonna chill in the middle lane. That's a box friend already, isn't it? No? Okay. What the little box like? Woo! 
Possible could be here. No, okay. Just making sure. No, it's not. Ugh. It looked a little box like. There we go. <laughs> Three left. Imagine after I do this, he goes, That's great, let's do it again. <laughs> Another set of 43 to do. If it happens, I'm not doing it again. Okay. Up to the spooky area. These things kind of remind me of something that would be in, um, Little Big Planet. Man, that's a game I should play. There was one for the PS5, but I never checked that out. That's another game that has a very nice art style. I'll be <laughs> the museum. I'm probably gonna have to watch this one a bit carefully. Because it could be attached to the wall that goes up and down, it could be in the background, it could be. Hold on. Everywhere. Oh, it's there. Wow. These have been quick, they've been in the first few seconds of the stages. It's already done. Alright, one more. it for a sec. This one's probably gonna make me go all the way through the stage. Since the last ones have been pretty lenient. I wonder if they'd be so cruel as to place it on the actual machine. I don't think they would. The unfortunate thing about the stage is it has a couple of points of no return. Like here. Yeah. 
No, Yoshi, please, climb. Awesome coming back. Out oh, there, cool. And that's it. I said. That's it. <laughs> Alright, what's this robot gonna say? Congratulations, you found Sprout in all the courses. Block of. <laughs> That's a cool costume. At the bottom, I would assume. Yahoo! <laughs> I like the outfit. Um, is it gonna make me do a challenge fight here? Yeah, okay. Oh, I did that the first time. Alright, easy. Just do it quickly. Okay. Well, we'll see. I definitely did the meteorite thing on my own, so that's good. Consider this practice for, like, what comes next. Isn't it? Oh no, I forgot. Sorry. I confused myself. I thought this was like <laughs> the other fight. Oh, you have to hit the central thing. No, you're hitting the. Oh, it doesn't damage you. Okay. We're fine. This is a little more lenient. I need to be more accurate with my eggs. I've already fucked it up. <laughs> I think the, the egg, the egg thing is gonna be the trickiest thing to juggle. Okay, that does, da that does no damage. Ah! This might not be as easy as I thought. Alright, I'll go for one goal at a time. The meteorite thing at the very least. I have to, so to do this quickly, I have to get all five of those things, and I have to not waste the eggs. It's just so easy to double tap. It seems to be very sensitive with the egg throwing. Wait for 
going up. Get rid of one hammer. Okay, so far so good. Focus on the no damage thing later. Let's just too quick. Or is it a no? Maybe it doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, this is gonna suck. Okay, I got a. Uh... Gotta get three eggs. It doesn't give you three eggs. I can't I can't hit it right now. You can probably hit it just once just to prime it. Wow. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> when two goals are gone, no. Nah. I might. Uh, I have to pull out the Super Nintendo controller again. I think. Just, I, I need the D-pad to be accurate, and it's just. I don't know. I find the pro controller's D-pad just to be very clunky at times. way to do this. Oh, jeez, I almost messed that up. like non-stop. Okay. <laughs> the 
focus so hard. But the problem is I need a third egg to land the killing blow here. I think that's where I've already messed up is like I could have had three eggs at this point. time do I have left? I don't have much time left. I have a minute. Motherfucker. I don't think I'm gonna get this one done. We'll go for the meteorite one. already time up. I'm not sure how I'm going to get this done really quickly. The time one I think is going to be the one that takes the most effort. can slap him. Okay. And that does help a lot. I could have done this hitless. Time one is going to be very rough to do. I can see it doing without any damage. That seems okay. It's more the time one. I have to cut two whole minutes off this. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. I'll figure it out. All right, no damage this time. That's what I'm aiming for. Hey, Colorin, how's it going?
It's officially September. Yep. It's spring for me. It doesn't feel like it. It's still raining and stuff outside. Supposed to rain a lot in spring. Not here. Here, winter's the rain season. Oh, really? Yep. You get rain in spring, but winter's the one where it rains the most. I threw. I keep ax. It's so easy to accidentally throw a double egg. I don't know. It's like if you were to tell me, like, oh, why isn't it snowing? Winter's supposed to be for snow. It's like, yeah, not here. Like, we have our own rules here. Spring is basically summer. And then summer is super summer. And then fall is summer. And then winter is, like, spring. <laughs> that's, that's... I think that's the best way I can explain it. Most seasons here are summer. Except for winter, which is just spring. And then summer is just super summer. damageless this time. Don't worry about the time-based one at the end. Oh no! I needed that to hit. Shit. I mean, it's okay, look. Like I'm going for the time-based one, I have to land all my eggs. Okay, I can't, yeah. See, if I would have had one more egg, I'd be able to hit him now. I think this is pretty much the reason I didn't get the time-based one. I have to be perfect with the egg throws. Okay, but I can prepare this one with one hit at least. Oh my god, what have I done? You know what, it doesn't matter. The time one's already out, out of the question. I, I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> okay. Now this is the part where I have to be careful. Thank <laughs> you. 
So there's only so much you can da you can damage him. The hammer. I'm just curious if it's better to. I think it's better to get both hammers. Oh man, I hate this. <laughs> oh, well, it's a dinner chicken. It's a very quick chicken. Whoa, fuck. I wasn't paying enough attention. Alright, well. Let me try and improve on this, I guess. is always good. That's an understatement. stressful. Um, I've already fucked up. Like, okay, I can hit him, but I didn't get the extra egg. Alright, it's just damageless now. You know, I'd be doing pizza. Man, I'll, I'll, I almost got a pizza today, but I was like, no, I should probably behave, so I just got chicken. Just at the end of the week, just feel lazy. <laughs> This is okay, work week's over. It's just the easiest thing. That's what I'd go for. better on time. It's all right. The time thing is going to be really tricky. Well, there's over for the three-day weekend, but you have a birthday tomorrow, so you have to clean the whole house after work. Ah, oh, that sucks. It's just one long ass day. I 
feel like the best way to do this is just load both hammers and just do it back to back. And there's always a sense of satisfaction with a clean house, but I just feel fucking wrecked up. <laughs> That hit? That's amazing. Oh my god, what am I doing? Hit him. Focus now. Oh, man. I know what this is. No, oh, fuck. Oh, the snow damage thing is so annoying. <laughs> Both of these objectives. <laughs> Alright. I get the feeling the last boss is just going to be easier to achieve this because it's... The hard part is just the end. Like, I had... I can do the actual last boss without taking damage until the very end. This one is causing me more problems. I'm not sure I'm gonna get the time one done. I may have to see how it's done because it's probably gonna require like a very specific thing. I'm almost positive it involves like catching every single Shy Guy rocket and making sure you don't miss a single egg. And just being ultra quick about everything. on this one, but I'll go for the no damage one.
Sorry, chat. I'm not looking at chat until this fight is over. I, I have to pay attention to everything. It's the no damage one. Like, after that, I can be a little more haphazard about it. Okay. First phase done. debating what the best course of action is for the time one. So that's that's an improvement. I hit the I have to use the left hammer because the right the meteorite falls to the right first. Left hammer first. Okay. Sorry, no damage is done. Hey, Kara. Hi, man. <laughs> okay. Now I can be a bit more haphazard about it. The time one is going to be rough. Well, it's not over yet. Now I've got to do it in 4 minutes 30, which is now going to require perfect movements. But I can take damage at least, so as long as I hit my eggs, it's fine. This fight is a lot of fun. It's a very good last boss fight. Well, second last. Like, at low key, once I want to play Hollow Knight, because <laughs> this just reminds me of Hollow Knight bosses a little bit. I mean, Hollow Knight bosses are a lot harder, but it's this concept. Like, if you're good at it and you learn the pattern, you can avoid all damage. Okay, that's 
That's all the damage I need to do for now. Hollow Knight is pretty. It is. It's a very, very nice looking game. I'll play it again at some point. Once the release date of Silk Song is known. Oh my god, I fucked it up. I threw another egg. <sighs> Damn it. I need to make sure that at the end of that phase I have one egg, so then the next phase I don't wait an extra turn. I think that that's all I need to perfect, and then everything else I think I got down. Oops. It wasn't because I took damage, it's because the, uh, the Shy Guy was... I wasn't gonna get the Shy Guy. I need every Shy Guy, and I need to hit every egg with the Shy Guy. I'm probably gonna swap to the Super Controller, a Super Nintendo Controller, it's just this D-pad is starting... ...to annoy me a little. Not to, but I can take it. No, oh, no. I know that it seems very minor, but I, ha I have. There's no other way to do it. Like one turn just takes too much time. I have to. Eat all the shy guys. Otherwise, it just it won't work out time wise. No, okay, I'm tired of this controller. I press up and then it registers like a. A what do you call it? A diagonal input. This is just the thing with the Pro Controller is it has an overly sensitive D-pad. If you've played something like Tetris with this thing, it, like, it's a nightmare controller. You'll accidentally slam your piece constantly. Okay, um... Give me a sec. I'm getting the superior controller out. You know I'm being serious when I pull this thing out. Yeah, yeah. Best D-pad. I don't understand it, like... <laughs> they, Nintendo has remade the Super Nintendo controller, and it has a really good D-pad, and yet the Pro Controller doesn't use this D-pad. Why? Like, it's, it's not like they're incapable of making a good D-pad. They've done it here. So much better. It just does not make sense. a miss. I did it in the wrong order. But this feels a lot better. 
Maybe it's personal preference, I don't know, but I just, I truly believe that this D-pad is the best. I threw three eggs. I panicked, I panic tapped. <laughs> All right, I'm confident I can get this. It's just I got I gotta play well. Go. And that's it. That's the end of that attempt. <laughs> it targeted the cog and it made me miss. Okay. I kind of want to do the last fight more than this one. I don't know, it, it feels more straightforward the other one. This one does a lot of waiting around. Just needed to go a little higher. Nice, thank you. All right, there we go. This is this is what I was trying to do. I shouldn't have gone for that, but I, I got the hit. <laughs> Jeez. I'm not going to do that again. I can't believe I got away with that. I should not have gotten away with that. Okay. Doesn't matter if I take damage. It doesn't matter. I've already done the damage loss run. I just need to succeed. Now this part, this is the part that I'm not sure what the most optimal is, so we'll see. I think it's collecting both hammers and then going that way, so lo let me try it. I'm almost positive it is. This has more room for error, thankfully. Okay. 
Okay. Left hammer first. How much time do I get? Four minutes thirty. Right, I got another minute. I got another minute. If it's not this, I may have to look at someone doing this. Because I can't think how else I could improve this. Okay, let's not, left hammer first. I don't think I'm gonna get it. This is still... There's 30 seconds left. Like, I'm honestly not sure how I could cut the time down more than this. Dude, there's 15 seconds left. Nah, this is... Alright. Um... Because that first phase, I feel like I've done as efficient as I can. I can't think how to make it more efficient, so it'd be this. Like, what do you do here? There's got to be some trick to this. I've tried throwing eggs as... Uh, it's okay, just, it's fine. Oh, I just realized what it is. I just realized what it is. I realized it a little too late, but I know what it is. So I need to cut off, like, 40 seconds. I think I know what it is. It's the part where I got the two hammers. I didn't hit them. So when I have the first hammer, I could have hit him to send them back. Okay, try again. If I don't get it this time, I'll I'll look. I think I'm doing this part pretty well. I can't imagine I can cut more than five seconds off this, if not ten. Yeah, the problem is you just have to wait around and there's no eggs. Curious if maybe like you use like you sacrifice a turn in the first one, so you have extra eggs. So then this part doesn't take as long, and you're not waiting like multiple turns because this, I think this is the shit that takes the longest. Might be wrong, but because we'll, we'll. what he has to do the hammers and then he has to do the cogs, or as in with the first phase, it's just one thing he, he does before he attacks you. Oh, 
good. And then I guess I just have to make sure I have one egg at this point. Alright, it's only two. It's fine. Alright, let's see. Just under two minutes. If I had an egg at this point, it would work, because I could... yeah, I don't know. It's honestly hard to tell how I could make this better. Okay, he's gonna jump here, and then I just whack him back immediately. There we go. Okay. I th that's where I, I didn't do well last time, I didn't do that. Fuck, man, I this is still bad. It's already over. Alright, I need to I need to look up how to do this. Um Hang on, give me a sec, chat. That is rough to do that in four minutes thirty. Alright, here's a video of the boss the boss challenge. Okay, so hold on, I'm just gonna try and skip to this as quick as possible, yeah? So I mean the first phase looks pretty much like what I did. It's you you're hitting everything with all the eggs. What I wanna see is if there's any tricks in the second phase. I want to see, like, what my time should be before you get up to the second phase. Alright, so this person had got there in two minutes. They're at... There with two... So, okay, now I have to watch the first phase. Because I think I was, like, two minutes thirty. Alright, so let me see. I think I might be right about the first phase, chat. Hang on. I think you just gather eggs in the first phase. Yeah. Immediately takes out the second phase so you're not waiting around. That's interesting. What is going on here? Okay, and then... Alright, I get it. Hang on, sorry, just still watching what they're doing. Oh, okay, got it. So, it's actually the other way around. I had the second phase done well. It's just this phase, <laughs> the the first phase that I. All right, got it. I didn't do well.
Okay. Let's try it. Let's try this method. So, pretty much I almost identical except one thing. And it makes sense now that I see it. So let's just... So this is, this is the tactic, right? Just... This is so sneaky. I would not have thought of this. But now you're back on full ammo, and then you do this. Right? So now when the next phase starts, I just take out the things right away. And r repeat it again. Okay. So do this again. So unbelievably sneaky, I would not have thought of this. It's okay. This is still an improvement. I have one egg, which is what I want for the next phase anyway. So I'm like 20 seconds behind the other person, but I'm also 20 seconds ahead of me. So I'm gonna I'm gonna probably watch the, the initial phase again and see just what they do, because that's where the improvements happen. I mean, I can probably comfortably do this. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, knock him back. Wait a minute. Oh my god. I just realized that as well. Yeah, shit, this is the way to do it. Why am I waiting for him to attack? I also just fucked it up. I just realized, but it's okay. I, I forgot to do the left side first. I got stuck in the button. Yeah, I could have probably had this if I had gone left instead. So while this is happening, there's no way to speed that up, hang on, let me see. I'm low-key watching this on the side. I just want to see if there's a way to improve on both hands. I've already, I've already messed that up. Alright, so by the looks of it... You have to wait one meteorite strike down. 
Hold on. I'm just... Pretty much the finale is the finale. So, okay, how do they do the first phase so quick? This is what I need to see. Okay, so then you get down to... You load up your eggs. Has five eggs. And then again... Collects up to six eggs. Sorry, I'm just skipping through it quickly. Okay, they don't bother. So then second phase, they actually wait out the star. Alright, got it. I know the full the full thing now. So I waited an extra cycle for more eggs, it wasn't worth it. That's pretty much it. Just so I could go in a bit heavier on on the second phase. Sneaky thing, honestly. And here I was trying to do things like super quick. <laughs> but I mean, even I realized it. Oh my god, what am I doing? I'm playing so slow. What? Why did it aim in the background? some weird targeting there. It targeted something in the background. I saw it again. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> Don't care about damage. I've already gone through that hell. needed to be sure that hit. Oh no! I forgot. <laughs> Just, when you do, when you're used to doing something over and over again a certain way, it just becomes... Ugh, you don't even think about it. I needed to wait to replenish my eggs and then hit them. It was the next one that I wasn't supposed to wait on. confident that the final fight's not going to take as long. It's more straightforward, and I got through it not only quickly, but without taking damage multiple times. It's just the final stretch that just sucks. Like, this one just has more waiting around. Oh, 
that's okay. Alright, wait. I have to wait for him. Again. And then the next phase is just all in. That's the, that's the time. That's 20 seconds better than before. So I have a full two minutes to resolve this now. Okay, this should be fine now. Just gotta remember to hit the left hammer first. That's the only detail. Left hammer first. moment he gets over here, hit him back, hit him again, white, left hammer, He's got less health than before. Okay. There's a whole minute left, so hopefully that's enough. Doesn't matter. Don't care. Christmas stars. Yep, Christmas stars. And then two eggs, and then that's it. I just gotta land the two hits. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck that. The aiming. Damn it. Oh, Alright, but I got it down. It's just... I should aim for the foreground, not the background. I mean, the background, not the foreground. The foreground throws are a little clunky. I got greedy. I went for the closest one. It's okay. This is straightforward, <laughs> now that I know. Wait, I don't... I thought, oh no, I've messed it up, but I haven't. It's, it's fine. 
I think. I have to wait two turns anyway, because it doesn't fully replenish my eggs and it gives you three. So it, it's fine either way. That's nice. I should have waited the extra second. Alright, I'm gonna wait for both of them to come down. I'm just not sure how tight the time is. Like, even with this, is, am I gonna just get it, or is it gonna be a case where I have, like, five seconds or so to spare? Almost did it. <laughs> Dangerously there. Oh my god. <laughs> I caved to the pressure a little. shouldn't matter too much. That's gonna matter. That's cool cursor. Like, it's aimed directly at it. That's where the cursor was. Now it's registering. Something I've definitely noticed about this game is just sometimes the throwing, the aiming is slightly off. I don't know why. It's okay. Doesn't matter. I have to wait two turns to replant. Wait, no. It does matter on the first one. It's the next one that doesn't matter. This one I have to get perfect. Because I have to end up with six eggs. I definitely reached the point of no return in this where I just... <laughs> I 
I kind of got suckered into doing the 100%. That's fun, though. I'm having fun. It doesn't feel frustrating. Okay. I just need to stop panicking and trying to do everything instantly and just wait like a second or two. I probably have more time than I think. Okay, this part definitely, like, patience. Waiting for him to come down here. Okay. And there we go. Alright. It's like three seconds ahead. Or behind, whatever. <laughs> Hopefully those three seconds aren't gonna matter, we'll see. But at least I got here. I got, like, roughly, uh, yeah, like about a minute to resolve this now. Okay, fingers crossed. I, it's, the, it's down to the last two eggs, I just have to hit them and not mess up. Time. Okay. I got it. Oh my god, no. I'm over, I'm over. Okay, so those four seconds matter. I was off by four seconds. Okay. So there's no leeway on this. I have to really, like, nail the first phase. It's doable. I think in the second phase I could have cut, like, one or two seconds off here and there as well. But yeah, this is, like, surgical stuff. Okay. 
I have a better idea of it now, though. For me to have a good chance, when it gets to phase two, the clock has to be 2.05 or better. If it's anything over that, I'm not going to get it. means I'm gonna have to go for the risky throws as much as I don't want to. I kinda have to. Sorry I haven't been, like... <laughs> you guys have been having your own conversation and chat about food. I've been, like, very to business. Yeah, I kind of have to focus on this one. Training for Hollow Knight. I'm still trying to catch Mewtwo. What in Pokemon Go or Pokemon? Oh wait, no, it's yeah. They have that event going on in the new games. Yeah, Scarlet and Violet. Have they made it run better yet, or is it still a no-go? Okay, we need two. I hate that I have to go for this epic shot here. I know exactly why I'm still doing this fight. I'm doing this fight because you need it for 100%, that's why. And it'll make me happy to get 100%. 203. And it is, it is kind of fun. Because of the song that never ends. I have no idea what that's referencing. And before people are like, what? You don't know that song? Oh my god. Play it now. There are things that I don't know. I mean, maybe I do, and I probably block. <laughs> no. Okay, it's fine. Maybe I do, and I block that out. I don't know. Mm. 
so it, it pretty much comes down to the last two throws. After absolutely like just reflex shot that shit. Hmm. 30 seconds remain. Ah, sold no, got me off the bottom. <laughs> no, fuck off oh, by one second because he pushed me off the bottom. <laughs> he pushed me off the bottom. Oh, I, I had that. Just the, the thing pushed me off the bottom. And I had to go do the pound again. If I would have gotten that ground pound the first time and hit him, it, that, that would have been it. I can do this. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> okay. That was so damn close, like, a anything could have just gotten me the win, when it's just one second, like, the smallest thing could have caused me to, to get that. Oh, man, can't believe how close that was. You have to be pretty much perfect to get this right. There's no, there's absolutely no leeway in this. I lied. There is one little bit of leeway here, and that is I can miss one, one shy guy. There is an extra shy guy here. Part is probably the hardest. Like, I have to go for the quick shot from the left one. I got even better. Last time it was 2 3, this time it's 2 1. <laughs> I, have, I have two extra seconds. Okay. I, I did even better this time. This has to be the one. Okay. 
looking good so far. A brief break, and then it's the thing that matters the most. Like, I have to land one egg right away. If I miss the second one, it's not that it's not the end of the world because I can just shoot again with the other the other thing. But that first egg absolutely has to land. Finally. Oh, man. Who's ready for hell? Oh, fuck that. Alright. The thing is with this one, I guess let me just try and do... At the very least, the damageless goal. And the platform goal. The time goal, I'll worry about it until the end. I like this fight better, to be honest. I'm gonna wait for another phase of this one. Oh wait, no, I did this last time perfectly, I don't need to do that. I remember. I just need to get back into the rhythm that I had going. Like, I actually had this fight down pretty well. <laughs> it's okay, first attempt in a while. Definitely done that goal to not allow the platforms to fall. I'm going for like speed as well now. I bet the speed is gonna is gonna involve like taking the boom gates down. We'll see. Oh, the pencil thing is the hardest to avoid. Um, let's just do one goal at a time. Yeah, no. Nah. It's too hard after that point. Damageless is nice, but. I'm not going to drive myself crazy first. I'm going to do the platform one. Then I don't have to stress about that one. Because that is basically walking on eggshells the whole time. Oh, 
I got the feeling this is gonna be the same where I have to extend the first phase, so then phase two is short. And phase three. We'll see. I know I said I wasn't gonna go for no damage, but that tilted me a little. Crayon time. <laughs> this one is like major RNG. Oh no! I took the damage just as I hit him. It's okay, I'm gonna keep going, I'm gonna keep going. I'll go for the one of not letting a platform die. I was like half a second sooner to that throw. It would have worked. Honestly, like like I said, this fight I feel like is easier. It's just this part that sucks. All right, so I didn't lose a platform. Unless it counts the platforms he's, he destroys, which I'm not even sure how you would do that. But let's just assume I'm okay. Like, I would have to gather eggs at that point. I'd have to hit all of his things. Holy shit, if I would have not taken that hit, that would have been damageless. I'm so angry. Because <laughs> this is the hardest part to get right. It took me forever to get this right yesterday. And I get it. <sighs> okay, well, that's unfortunate. If I wouldn't have taken that hit with the pencil, this would have been damageless. Or did I take a sec? I can't remember. It, it doesn't matter. I didn't cause any plat. All right. Oh, I got the time one. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I thought that was going to be the hardest one. All right, cool. Fuck yeah. See? This, this fight is easier from a time perspective. I All right. No, it's just the other two goals. Alright, I'm good. That was awesome. Um, so I guess, now that time isn't a factor, I'm gonna gather eggs and I have to stop him from destroying platforms, it would seem. But no, how am I gonna do- No, I can't do that, because there's- In the middle point, he eats one. Alright, I'm gonna go for the damageless run first. We'll worry about that complexity of the platform thing at the end. I can't believe I got that. Oh, my God. 
So I can stop this attack if I have eggs. It's just, how do I stop him from eating... Like, this is the part that I'm not sure. They're not falling like he's destroying them. That's the part that I don't get. It's like, they're not really fall. Unless I cause- no, I, call I may have caused one to fall here. Fuck. It's okay, as long as I don't take a hit. It's possible I, I caused one to fall, fall there. The crayon thing, like, it has to be... It's RNG, but I need him to, to be in the middle. Like, if he goes to the edges, it's too hard to hit him quickly. But if he appears in any of the middle two ones, I get it every time. I'm so happy that I got the time-based one. Like, I thought for sure that was going to be the one that took me the longest to do. I don't know what I don't know why I'm doing like it super efficiently with But I mean I guess just play like I wanna play my best. I just need it. That's gonna hit me. <laughs> I just need it to put him in the right spot. That's all. It's one and four every time, so. Well, I think it's one and three actually because it can be either middle two as long as it's not the edge ones i really like this fight it's fun Okay, here we go. Come on, Iron Jesus. There it is. No, I platform fell, but okay, damageless. Damageless. Okay, damageless. Fuck! <laughs> Damn it. I jumped too early. I think, yeah, the pencil part is definitely where I lost one. More or less what happened there is what I need to happen is Kamek being like in the immediate vicinity of where I'm aiming. So the pencils he's shooting don't hit me. The sad thing is, I've probably done this, naturally, already. It's just because it was the first time clearing it. It probably didn't register. Maybe not the damageless one, but the platform one, for sure. Oh, 
asshole. Yep. <laughs> Went on the complete opposite side. Yeah, the stamageless one is gonna be the more brutal one, it would appear. It's the pencil part, and then the part at the end that's the most troublesome. This part is the easiest, the car one is like second. This is the tricky part, is just the pencil bit. Come on, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Got it. I didn't lose a platform either. Let's go. This is another difficult one to like, not lose a cog. I mean, not lose a plat, but took damage. All right, I'm going for the platform one. All right. Okay, cool. Let's just finish the level now. Then I focus on damageless and there's no need to concern myself with the platform shit anymore. This is why damage is going to be the hardest one. I cannot believe I got that first try, like, just before. really sucks. Fuck. <sighs> Alright. Never mind, I didn't get it. It's okay. I can do the platform thing. Most times I do end up doing it that way. It's just... I'd rather not be, like, conscious about it, you know? Like, thinking about it. <laughs> I can't believe the pencil thing. Like... I wouldn't have gotten hit with the pencil thing that time I won, this would be just straightforward at this point. I would have gotten the time and the damageless one at the same time. It's okay. Just gotta move on. Um, I didn't cause a platform to fall, so it's okay. Just focus on that one. As long as one thing gets achieved, it doesn't matter. You have to hit him before it gets to the blue pencil parts where they're just dropping constantly. Thank <laughs> you. 
Gotta win now. This is training <laughs> at the same time. idea how I managed to do this like first try. I struggled so much with this yesterday. Okay, got it. Alright, that's two objectives done. Now I just gotta <laughs> gotta do the damage this long. Well, unless I'm missing for some reason. Just the middle one that remains. Now I have to play my best, but at least I don't have to walk on eggshells. A, plat a platform can fall. I can't believe I got the time on. I'm so happy about that. I think the damage this one is pretty much getting the time on. If you're doing a damage list, it means that you've done the fir the end part first try, so you're probably going to get the time on as well. Provided you've done this part like as quick as you can. Oh, I wish me luck. And that's a restart. <laughs> I missed. <sighs> this is this happened to me with Kirby. Kirby was the latest Kirby game was so relaxing and fun, but then the post game stuff was just insane. Like it, it had some difficulty to it. It's kind of the same. Tenacity indeed. I know I'm capable of it. I hate this. Oh, okay. No! <laughs> Fuck. Oh, I knew it. As soon as I, I leapt off that thing, I'm like, nah, I did that way too late. <sighs> oh. I'm getting, I'm getting upset. <laughs> hey, cat. I'm guessing you're, en you're enjoying the spectacle, huh? Oh, 
Do I need two eggs? I don't think I need two eggs. I think I'm fine. Oh, the way I, was, I said n no, no, no. The way I said no, huh? <laughs> Do I have to say it like that? I'm okay. Deep breath. It's the pencil. It, all right. Order of things that are the, the hardest to avoid. The end part, that very finale sequence, the and then the pencils. Those are the two things that can mess me up to the point where I have to restart. The cars are like close third, but it doesn't happen as often. He always has to appear at the opposite end. <laughs> it's a one in three chance. Ugh. I can only imagine how much more insane this would be if this was random. Like, at least... Well, at least... There's a reliable pattern up until this point. Like, this is where it gets random. I don't have, I don't have to worry about the falling platform. It doesn't matter. I've already done that. Alright, now... Don't fuck up. Cool, I fucked up. Alright, anyway. I thought when I was talking the car horn went off. I have to listen to the car horn. I need to shut up when I get to that part. I'm going to shut the fuck up the moment I get to that part. <laughs> I don't know why I'm, st I'm just trying to keep that platform alive. Brush up. Shh. Okay.
comes. This is this is the part that I'm the, the most worried about. This part sucks. Oh, it almost got me. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't just land the last hit. That's it. That's it. Just gotta land the last hit. Let's go! That's it. Controller down. Dude, I almost got all three objectives. I was 0.68 off clearing all three at once. But whatever, I already did the time one. Okay. You cleared all the Kamek Kerfuffle boss stage challenges things. You have fully gathered all the smiley flowers. Um, hold on. Now... This is it. Grand finale, everyone. Hundred percento. <laughs> I was just wondering the whole time what are they going to do with this many flowers left over? Well, that's the answer is you just have to spend them all at once at the end. What's it going to do? My thanks to you, I'm as full as can be. Here, allow me to give you something in return. It's just a costume, I bet. The, yeah, so... That's it. <laughs> that's... That's my reward. Congratulations. Yahoo! No, like, special fireworks display or anything. This is, this is my reward. It's better than poop. You know what? You're right. And at least this... I feel very satisfied that I did that. Got through that fight without taking damage. And did it quickly. Okay, well, there we go. Finally, we have reached the end of Yoshi's Crafted World. A game which I thought was going to be short, and it's got a surprising amount of content. Um, if you're trying to 100% it, which, yeah. I think it's fun. You never understood these type of rewards, like you 100% the game and they give you cosmetics. Like, bro, I'm done. Yeah, I would have preferred like a special cutscene to play or something, you know? Because then it's like, oh, this is something you only see when you finish the game in this way. It's fine. It's bragging rights, I guess. At, le at least here I have a VOD that goes, hey, look at what I did, you know? Alright, well, anyway, if you've reached the end here, thank you so much for sticking around, uh, if you're watching later on YouTube. Hope you've enjoyed the playthrough of this one, and we can now finally rest our ears from this recorder music. Uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the playthrough, be sure to remember to click buttons and stuff, because YouTube loves that stuff. And it also helps the channel a lot, so thank you to those that have done that. Yeah. Appreciate it a lot. Uh, and I'm sure by now YouTube's probably popping up two other videos of mine if you want to watch me play through something else. So, hope you do. But yeah, thanks for watching uh, me play through Yoshi's Crafted World. I'll see you next time. Bye, YouTube.